Trying to find value inside of the silver market is sometimes a challenge. The easy default is always, hey, let's just get a one ounce round or a silver eagle, right? It's one ounce. How much? And move on. But part of the fun in the coin hunt is, is well, there's other ways of doing it. You know, to get to a dollar, it's 10 dimes, two half dollars, four quarters, right? Uh, so there's lots of options. And every once in a while, you find the old 90 percenters at a bargain. And tonight, this is a bargain. Not Roosevelt dimes. Roosevelt dimes. But not the P's and D's, everybody. These are the special proofs only found in proof sets. So prior to 1964, Philadelphia made proof sets 90% silver. They transitioned uh, in 1968 over a clad in San Francisco. These are the dimes that came out of those proof sets from 64 and back. Again, 90% silver. So in that graphic, we'll just get right to it, it's up to 10 different. So if you purchase that quantity of 10, you'll get 10 different dates from 64 and back. So that just goes to show you that we are way back into the mid 50s on these uh, vintage silver proofs. Again, $6.95. Our competition sells uncirculated coins for north of $15 a coin. The rarer proof, a fraction. Now they sell them for way more, but here are some numbers just to look at. Let's just take 1957, one of the older coins in this grouping. Philadelphia made 160 million, Denver made 113 million. Well, it's the coin of, it's the silver coin of the realm. It's the coin we use the most often. They're gonna be making more quantities, I understand that. They only made 1.2 million proofs. Significantly rarer. 1964, the last year they made 90% silver dimes. You had 929 million P's, 1.3 billion D's. So add them together, 2 billion unks and only 2.1 million proofs. How about that as just a special scenario? So it just tells you we're looking for the rarer coin, the proof. But now it comes down to the cost per coin. $6.95 tonight with us, and our closest competitor was $25.50. That's not even close. $25.50, and if you wanted that variety of 10 different, even using their lowest price of $25.50 or $255 to get a quantity of 10, uh, with us, you're at $69.50 with a quantity of 10. And again, That's our 10 will be 10 different. We guarantee the Yours, 10 different. coin by coin with them, is not $250 because the latter coins the 57s, the 56s, the 55s, the 54s, they're selling for $30, $40, $50 a coin or more. Well, to give you 10 different, this logic is 64 backwards means if we gave you a decade run, it would be 55 up. So think about that. And if they're at $35, $40 for 1955 alone, and it's in this group at a quantity of 10, because it has to be, wow, what a value. So you have the value there. You have the condition of a proof, which is a taken from a proof set. Proof sets were struck for collectors with a lot of intricacy. Uh, they were made to be the collector set. You know, struck twice on highly polished dies. It gives you that gorgeous mirror-like appearance as well. And don't forget, they are 90% silver. They didn't transition to clad proof sets until 1968 after that small run of SMS sets when they did not make any proof room in sets from 1965 through 1967. 1964 ended that era. Philadelphia 90% silver proof sets. These are the dimes that came out of those proof sets. And tonight you can get those dimes for $6.95 each savings. Again, our competition is at least $25.50. And you're getting a variety of dates. You just said get 10, you're going to get a decade's worth of different dates. All, I mean, all it's the board. guaranteed in this process. I mean, again, yes, Hunter, they can buy more than 10. We're not capping course, people yeah. at these types of offers. We're just telling you how many different will be inside of it. So if you're looking to put together some just very valuable proofs for a very affordable number, how about this? But here's another spin. Let's just take a journey in a different area. A proof silver eagle today, which say a proof dollar, right? Which are the affordable coins that come out every year. A 2023. My competition's at 120 to 130 a coin. We sold out at 99.95. So $100 for a one ounce silver proof from this year. Not too shabby. Kind of where the market is, right? Let's do the math. 2.5 grams in a silver dime means you gotta have 12 dimes to get the same weight. That means we're at 83.40. Now when you look at silver, 90% silver, the dimes, the quarters and a half dollars, it's not uncommon that you will see a 
small gap. You might see today quarters are a nickel or so cheaper on the, on the per ounce. You might see half dollars a little bit more expensive because people like the bigger coins. Dimes might be more expensive just because of the supply issues. So it always changes. But they're always relatively close to that of what a one ouncer is, right? Well, today a one ouncer is at 100 and these are at 83. It's not close. Plus the variety, plus these are 75 years old compared to the Silver Eagle, which is brand new. It's just a great opportunity, a great value, and unfortunately, we don't have a lot of them. Yeah, speaking of that, we're going to put that clock up, one minute clock, please. You're talking about the youngest coin in this presentation is almost 60 years old. These are 64 and back, 1964 and back. Again, quantity of up to 10 different available. So if you join us with 10, you'll get 10 different dates. Online, if you're shopping via the website, that's avccoins.com. Just enter that item number, 905-9068, into your search bar and grab the quantity that works for you. Some people, it looks like they're grabbing 20. That's great. Each one are individually encapsulated. They are 90% silver proof, so you want to keep them as pristine as they are uh, from taken right out of that proof set. So you don't, no scratches or anything. It'll come to you in a beautiful little pouch as well. It's, it's, it's really the best, collect. but again, the simple value, 1964, 2550, 1961, 2550, 1959, 2950, 1957, 2950, 1956, 3450. Unks, 15, 18 a coin. These are the rarer proofs. They made two billion in 64, and they're selling for 15 dollars a coin. They made 3.9 million 64 proof sets and they're selling for less money, significantly less money. This is a crazy opportunity. Bear with us with the operators. It's worth the wait, but it is time for us to be moving on.